want to hear the voices of the people who live in the drylands. This session will get us to that point. Um, and we are going to start with a story. It's a story about the people who live in the dryland areas and the ways in which they deal with climate and environmental shocks. Because as we moved, others also moved. And this is through something we call in our community called uh, Dabare. Dabare is sharing of your livestock with the, with the people who lost. We must look at the long-term resilience. How do we build the long-term resilience? Do your husband as very well. Invest in the capacities of your local, your first responders, the community. They are the ones who act the first. So we need to build in their capacity. Uh, hub uh, event that we organize. We hope that the audience learn that pastoral is uh, the world three important phases in terms of uh, responding to climate crisis. They first respond to the crisis such as drought when it emerge, and thereafter they need time for recovery, and then they have to establish their resilience capacity through different uh, actions such as uh, building relationships with the neighboring communities and also with technologies and uh, things that evolve around their life.